animals in our community. Here with ways you can help is Mila Bella Vasquez with the LASPCA. And Mila Bella has a special guest with her this morning. Good morning. Hi, good morning. Um, I have Jeanette with me. She's a three-month-old kitten. She's very rambunctious. You can see she's already trying to play with things and escape. <laughs> I know she's, she's spotting stuff across the studio. She's like, I think I want to lunge over there, but yeah. just hold tight with us, Jeanette. We won't, we won't take too long, too much of your time this morning. <laughs> but Mila Bella, today is Giving Tuesday, and obviously you guys would love if people can give financially uh, to the LASPCA. Any little donation, what can that do to help you all in your operations? So any donation, um, up to 75000 is a three times match, and um, the donations really help with any spay and neutering, any uh, medical attention that any cat or dog needs, food, water, and the basics to make sure that they're comfortable. Which goes a long way, especially during the holidays when you start to see more pets uh, come in and, and people uh, needing assistance as far as their pets are concerned. I know everyone can't give financially. That That's always a thing. And yeah. they may feel bad, but you want people to know not feel bad, not yeah. to feel bad. They can give in other ways, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you can't give financially, definitely we've all been there. We understand. But you can donate your time. Um, you can volunteer at the shelter as well. Um, you can foster an animal, which is giving them a loving home until they find their forever loving home. And then finally you can, oh, hey, and then finally you can adopt. Um, adopting is really what we need right now. Um, we're at capacity, which means that we don't have um, any room for any more animals. So as long as we can get them out to loving homes, um, it's perfect. Oh, no, she's eating your necklace. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. So, but, but back to, to volunteering. I know mm -hmm. you guys have a, a whole operation going. Um, what, what kind of volunteers do you need? What do you need help doing day to day? So pretty much day to day um, for volunteering, we just need people to uh, get newspapers, sort out the newspapers, put them in the cat kennels for the cats, and then uh, help feed the dogs and walk them. Um, just make sure that they get good, loving interaction because without love, you know, what's the point of it? And Mila Bella, I know we're about to go into the holiday break. Kids will be out of school. Can can kids and teenagers volunteer? Yes. Um, so if you're under 18, you do need a parent's permission um, and for them to sign your permission slip. But you can always volunteer with your parent if you want. Uh, the more the merrier. So whoever wants to come, you're welcome. All right. Well, Mila Bella, I'm going to let you go because uh, she's about to take a, take a leave. <laughs> really quickly, where can people go for more information on all that you do and to give and to give of their time and, and talent? Yeah. Um, you could go to LASPCA.org to see all of our adoptables, to see if you want to meet your friend and um, keep up to date with new events. All right. Well, Mila Bella and Jeanette, thank you both so much.